Ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba. What's the good word, gang? Matt here, Country Song Teacher. Hope you're doing well. First off, uh, Saturday was my birthday. Got tons of messages and little um, kind words of encouragement and all this stuff. So if you tell me happy birthday, even if you didn't, thank you so much, man. I had an awesome time with family and stuff, and we're ready to see what God has in store for us for this next year ahead as a 29-year-old. Anyway, so I'm going to show you a quick little blues, kind of a blues slide kind of thing. It's good for your finger picking, working on your timing, and um, just kind of an overall little fun little riff to play that I've been playing for a while. Uh, it's going to sound like this. So to kind of break it down, it's made up of three parts. So first you're gonna play kind of like a D7 chord. I don't know if you're familiar with a D7, but you play the second string of the first fret, then your third and bottom string of your second fret. But you're gonna slide it up to the third and fourth frets. So you're gonna have your second string of the third fret, the third and bottom string of your fourth fret. What you're gonna do for this first picking pattern, take your pick, the third string, Pick down and then go up on the bottom. So one, two, down on three, and you're gonna slide it down, same thing, slide it down, and the same thing. So like this. I ain't throwing up there, but. So you're basically playing nine notes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So start out with the third and fourth. Remember, you're picking down on the third string, up one, two, as you go those three progressions. Then you're gonna play the third string open. Then play the third string first fret. Play the fourth string second fret. Then open, open one, two of the fifth string. So open third string. So open. Then the, then the first fret of the third string, it's going to sound like this. So open, so on the third string, open one, then go to the second fret, fourth string, then on that fifth string, open one, two, so again, like this. And you slow it down, open third, four, open one, two. Then you're going into the final part, that little blues sub. Well, I guess the kind of slide part. You're gonna play the, the sixth and fifth string. You're gonna just press the fifth string with your middle finger, first finger, whatever. I use my middle finger. So second fret, you do two down. Go to the fourth fret, then the fifth fret, then back to the fourth. Man, I got a $3,000 Taylor guitar here. I gotta take it in, something's vibrating. It's driving me crazy. Um, it's the nicest guitar I own. I don't know why it sounds weird. Uh, so, anyway. So you do that twice. Then you move down to the fourth string. Again, the second fret. And you're playing the fifth and fourth string. So on all these, you're going two, four, five, four, back up. Five, six. You're always to a two strum. Now you're gonna play the final little part to wrap it up. You play a B7 chord, which is similar to the chord shape you formed down here, except you're playing the fourth string, fourth string of the uh, first fret, fifth and third string, second fret. So you're going down, 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 down. Then go down to a regular A chord, which is third string, second fret, fourth string, second fret, second string. You're squeezing all your fingers. Third and above it and below it. So again, it's going to go B7. And back to that little 
blues part. That's my guitar humming. Anyway, so again, I'm gonna go kind of slow. This is what you're gonna do. The picking part, the walk up, the, the slide, and the two chords. First little intro, if you want to play a little bit of blues music, y'all know me, I mostly do some regular old. Well, she got the best of me. She broke my heart now. Just, you know. I'm not very good at that kind of lead and picking strings, but if you do kind of have some exercises where you kind of pick the strings, it'll help you with your timing, your overall finger picking. Like, I love the Backstreet Boys, I want it that way. Do your boy a favor, give the video a thumbs up. It helps the YouTube algorithm. And check out my website, countrysongteacher.com. So many of y'all bought my four chord songbook this weekend. Uh, so thank you so much. That's that's the birthday present if you bought that. So thanks so much. It's four, 40 songs that use just G, C, E minor, D. Just those four chords. And what happens when you get the songbook, it's digital. You can click on the title and see a lesson for each of the 40 songs. So it's all popular songs you know uh, if you haven't gotten it already. It's 40 songs. Just using four chords, G, C, E minor, D. So go check that out, countrysongteacher.com after you smash the like button. We'll keep rocking and rolling. Tomorrow we'll probably do a, a video on Walker Hayes. We fancy like Applebee's on a day night. Had a few questions that one, so I'll do that one tomorrow also. Let me know in the comment section below what we teach this week. And I'll do my best to make it happen. Let's go.